The car is back in the building, and it looks good if I do say so myself. So now that we got everything where it belongs, so the quarter panels, the fenders, none of that stuff's changing, so we can measure and get the right tire we need from TireRack.com, because there's gonna be a lot of choices. We wanna make sure we get the right rubber for this dude. Then, it's time for the big reveal. I gotta tell you, it's always nerve wracking when you're gonna go face somebody and say, hey, this is how I spent your 50 grand. Oh my God. <laughs> Alan. Oh. Got the right shirt on. Wow. Wow. Is that a happy wow or a mad wow? That's a happy wow. Okay, good. Wow. I knew it wasn't going to be black when Lou called me, but I didn't. Is, is this a wrap? No, that's that's paint. We flex our muscles on this one. You're kidding me. No, that's every wow. ounce of it covered this in it. This is amazing. Yeah. Oh my goodness. And then changed really? all the trim to black, you know, anything that was chrome. It was really nice that it has the glass roof. We just left all that. So it has that just that nice, shiny black down the center, you know, and these colors play so well together. If you look at the caliper color, that's a custom color that we mixed up. Okay. But showed off the lines of the car uh -huh. and didn't take away from anything, you know. So this is what we ended up with. You do something to the engine as well, right? Yeah, yeah. We actually upgraded the turbos to the same ones that are on your CLS. This is amazing. That's cool, isn't it? The transformation of this car from what we started with to what we have now, we went from conventional weapons to nuclear power in a short span. We're talking total chaos. That's what this car is.